Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. Second video of the day. Today again it's Thursday, May 23rd, 2019. Uh, very, very busy day. So a lot of progress today. Absolutely awesome. Um, really, really pleased. So I'm going to just show you basically back here first. That's all cleaned out now. That is a huge stump. I told him to leave it. I don't care. Let it stay there. Uh, so we cleaned out up and through here. Got that all cleaned out did all through in this area so he's got it opened up more uh, it was he said it was really nice and dry in here as well so that I was like that's cool but look at the soil guys this soil up through here is just absolutely awesome so when uh, you know we start expanding so I'm gonna I'm gonna go back this way when we expand the uh, the orchard you know we'll expand the orchard I may Put a building back up in here someplace as well eventually I'm not sure we'll see what happens with that but uh, I want to put a place in here for Eddie so we're gonna see where that's gonna go and that'll be down the road but uh, so all this stuff that was uh, that he had the stumps and everything that he had pulled out they are now all over there I asked him to push that all over there so that's out of the way that's over there I'll worry about that down the road uh, eventually as you guys know over here is going to be where the pond is going to go and uh, I want to try to keep the rest of it more woodsy if I if I can but I needed this area you know like I said cleaned up more so that I could decide what I'm going to do here because eventually guys I'm going to have you know a goat pen I'm going to have you know a place for uh, a pig every year you know so I, I needed to have this more squared away and uh, like right there, that was, I mean, it was just a bunch of crap all through there. And I cleaned some of that out last year with the chainsaw. But, uh, you know, with opening this up like this, this is absolutely awesome. So uh, I'll show you what else. So we got the trench built or dug where the solar rack is going to go. Okay, so I'm going to show you that. And then uh, I've been splitting wood. It's about 2 in the afternoon now, and we're supposed to have like thunderstorms by 4 o'clock. So, uh, this is the trench. Now, you can see water standing in it. Uh, it's about maybe a foot deep of water. But we got the trench in here now, so we're going to be placing the poles in there, and then, you know, we're going to backfill it. That's going to be a fun job. <laughs> but uh, we had to dig the trench and not just holes, because we're going to be running... Uh, piping in there as well so that's going to have uh, the pipe for the uh, wires and stuff in there as well so that's why it was done like this but uh, so this is going to be the trench that's where the rack for the solar panels is going to go and it's going to be able to uh, be extended on as well so that'll be it'll be fun but yeah so this is uh, all the dirt and that's that part's dug up as well so we flattened everything else out he took all those stumps out of there and again and push them all the way back up into that back corner so really really excited uh, like I said got a lot of good stuff done today and I have been splitting wood today again so I'll take you over here and I did a video earlier today and I was showing you what I was working on uh, I finished up all this wood through here started doing more of this wood over here and I'm gonna tell you what I'm just tired I've uh, had enough for today so I think that that is going to be all I'm going to do for today. I can finish this up tomorrow. It won't take me that long to finish that up tomorrow, especially with it stacked like that. It's a lot easier. Uh, all the small pieces are pretty much done. But I'm going to kind of give you an idea how big this freaking pile is. I'm going to turn this around here. So, yeah, it's a, it's a lot of freaking wood. Uh, a lot of splitting. So, real happy with it. I mean, it's just, uh, you know, banging these things out. And then, like I said, the next step after everything is split is getting it stacked. And, uh, you know, then uh, we're going to be moving on to other projects. Again, the first weekend in June, guys, we're going to be working on, the, um, on getting everything done. And, again, these are the poles that are going to be going into the ground. So, uh it's going, to be, it's going to be a major job, but it's going to be fun, and it'll be exciting, and I'll be glad when it's done. But, uh, so yeah, that's what we've been making great progress. I'm like, I, honestly, guys, I can't even begin to tell you how pleased I am 
with the way everything has gone and with everything that we're getting done here at the homestead. Uh, everything is right on course uh, for what we wanted to get done this year. So, like I said, again, I'm really, really happy about the whole thing. And uh, it's coming together. So, you know, but uh, one step at a time, one thing at a time, and one day at a time, right? It's, uh, but like I said, all this wood is now, this part, like I said, is all split. And uh, so good, I don't even know how much is there, to be honest with you guys. I mean, I think right there alone might be maybe five four or five face cord i don't know i'm not 100 percent sure and i still have all of this to split so again i'm going to wait till tomorrow i'm going to cover this up here in a minute and uh, i will work on this again tomorrow and finish it up tomorrow or maybe i'll do it tonight i don't know we'll see depends on my mood depends on how i feel but uh, i might i might come back and bang it out some more today i don't know yet we'll see but uh Anyway, so that's what's happening here at the homestead today. Uh, again, just making steady, steady progress. Really, really happy. Uh, I might work on trying to get the garden in this weekend. I'm not 100% sure yet <laughs> if I'm going to do that or not. But uh, So it's pretty much ready to go. Uh, I'm not going to expand the garden this year. I'm just going to work in this area again. I may do... Uh, some raised beds I might do that for potatoes so I'm, I might do something like that I'm not a hundred percent sure yet so but that's what uh, that's what we're focusing on you know we're just like I said I'm just really really excited uh, there's a few more things I still need to do with the chicken coop before we do get chickens but we will be getting chickens this year guys so you will be seeing that as well and again we're just making that progression and uh, I'm really really happy with the way everything is going and so things are going really, really good. And uh, like I said, just really, really pleased. It's, uh, you can see it's overcast. See, it's, now it's funny, because look over there, there's some blue skies over there, but all through over here, it's all overcast. And they were saying that by like uh, four o'clock, we're gonna have a 90% chance of rain. I did get a little bit of rain on me earlier, and I just kept going, because it was a light rain, but then it stopped again, but uh, like I said, real good day, very productive day, real, real pleased. Uh, things are moving along, and uh, we're getting there, and that's what it's all about, you know. So uh, the next chore, and the kids will just love it when we get to that point of stacking all this wood, because they love to stack wood, hate it, they can't stand it. But we work at it together, and it gets done. So I want to see, well, when I do tomorrow's video, I'll let you know if I got back to this or not, and, uh, and worked on this or what I did but uh, I may I may come back and do some more of it later I just got to chill for a little while right now <laughs> so but uh, so yeah again like I said very very good day making progress uh, things are coming together and uh, the homestead is gonna be awesome I mean I just I have a lot of plans guys lots and lots of plans and uh, you guys are gonna get to watch it all take shape I mean and it's just like I said we're just gonna keep working at it and we're gonna get there and that's the cool thing about it. It's just gonna, it's gonna just, it's gonna happen. So, anyway, uh, that's it for right now. So uh, I guess I'm going to jump off of here. I just want to remind everybody. I think what we're gonna do is I got to talk to Mike. I think we're gonna extend the sale on the Legacy products through um, the Memorial Day weekend. So if anybody wants to take care of that over the Memorial Day weekend, they can still have time to do that. So what we're going to be doing is it's 25% off any kind of legacy meal, uh, bucket meal. If you order one of those, you will get 25% off. Again, check that out at my website, and, uh, you know, you can do that there. And uh, so Bill's leaving right now with his bulldozer. He's going to come back and get the excavator at another time. But uh, so check that out. Uh, also on my channel, we have the Prepper Nurse One community. So check that out as well. You can, uh, that's completely free to join. It's a way for preppers to get together and meet other preppers and, uh, you know, coordinate. And if you want to try to form a group in your state and stuff like that, you can. It's very, very private. So you have to be registered. Nobody can just come in and see what's going on there. So that makes it really nice that way. So um, if you're interested, please go over to my website again, preppernurse1.com, and check that out. All right, guys, well, I'm going to jump off here from now, and uh, so I don't know if this video will go up today or go up tomorrow because I have 
I'll, I'm going to be putting up two videos today. I did one earlier, and then this one will probably end up going up tomorrow. So I'll do a regular video tomorrow as well. But uh, like I said, been busy, so I wanted to show you as we were doing things, okay? So remember, guys, we're all in this together. That's important to remember. Also remember, hug and kiss the ones you love. Tell them every single day. Tomorrow is not guaranteed. We never know what's going to happen in life, so it's really, really important that we tell you, you know, the people that we care about every single day. And remember, guys, STD. It's one step at a time, one thing at a time, and one day at a time. Whatever you're trying to get done, whatever you're trying to accomplish, you can do it. You can get it done. The only one that can stop you from doing it is yourself. Nobody else can stop you, okay? So I will talk to you all later. I hope everybody's having a great day. Prepper Nurse One, out for now. Lucy Luce. What you doing, Lucy?